Hello everyone, welcome to Pokedex, the channel where I build decks for the Pokemon trading card game. Today though, I do not have a deck for you, this is a little bit of news that I just saw. So it seems that the format rotation for 2016 has been revealed, and it's from X and Y on, uh, unsurprisingly. Uh, it's the rotation that everyone was kind of expecting. Maybe legendary treasures could be in there somewhere, but yeah, the uh, X and Y on was the, the thing that made mo the most sense. So I guess um, everyone was kind of... Uh, I don't know, kind of expecting it, so yeah, no, no real surprise there. I've seen some videos um, of other people looking at the format once the rotation happens, but until Ancient Origins, the full English spoiler uh, is out, I don't really like to look at the, um, the meta. I don't know, I think Pokemon players live uh, in the future too much, because we get the the spoiler for the Japanese sets and we worry too much about the, what's going to happen in the three months to come which doesn't happen for example in Magic the Gathering I mean people only look at the rotation once it actually happens because that's when the deck is the formats uh, the sorry the expansions are spoiled so anyways it doesn't matter we will look at the format once Ancient Origins comes out and we are sure what cards are going to be out or not but yeah, it seems seems fine. I mean, we are going to lose some uh, interesting cards like N, for example, which I think make a lot of difference. Just the fact that you don't need to worry too much about losing your whole hand after uh, committing to knocking out some Pokemon is actually, I think, a big game changer. I think it's actually the thing that, th in my opinion, that's the thing that's going to change the most because it not only changes how you build decks, but it changes the way you pl actually play out the games. So yeah, there's that. Um, another interesting part of this news is that the expanded format will not be rotating out any expansions, which actually makes a lot of sense. Uh, I don't know if any of you were expecting that the format rotate, rotated some expansions out, but I'm really glad that it didn't. Actually now expanded is different from, from uh, standard, we can say that for sure, uh, totally different formats. Uh, the black, both black and white, uh, not blo both. <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of black and white, black and white sets. What I meant was, both the ones that rotated uh, the last year and the ones that are rotating now uh, will have a lot of impact in the um, in the format. I mean, you can still use lasers and verisians and all that. So, yeah, I guess expanded is actually going to be different from standard, and that's a good thing in my opinion. Uh, we actually have two different formats now and that's really cool for players that like to play a lot like I do so we can maybe stores can choose between uh, two different formats and that's more variety and I really like that I also like the fact that there's a format that values cards that we had uh, in the past so if there was no expanded formats what do you do to the cards after they rotate out they pretty much lose all their value I mean you can collect them but that's that's it that's basically it um, so because there's expanded format now people will actually have a, a reason to keep the cards around and keep the decks they really like and they can potentially play them in the future and that's really cool I think that's exactly what happens in Magic the Gathering and that's one of the the best things that Magic had that Pokemon did not have another thing that this means is that the people doing the uh, uh, the cards, the people making the cards, actually now have to pay attention to power creep, which I think was something that has kind of been increasing a lot. I mean, I remember when I played Pokemon in the back in first edition, and the cards have only become powerful and powerful, so more and more powerful. So that's uh, uh, that's not great uh, to have in a game where things only go up. We need kind of a web and flow of things, um, some things getting stronger and then other things getting a little bit weaker, uh, have different things uh, shining at different times. So this kind of means that they kind of have to have that uh, extra special attention not to make uh, future cards way more powerful than older cards because that would mean that the expanded format would just become the standard format, right? Um, so yeah. Uh, I think it's really good news that we have two different formats now and well I, I'm basically making this video so that you guys can comment and tell me what you think as well in the comments below so yeah what's your opinion was the rotation uh, was the set chosen uh, on to the, for the rotation the right choice and uh, do you like the expanded format and will you be playing and are you excited that there's actually two different formats now Tell me what you think and until the next video, see you guys.